A Texas prenuptial agreement establishes what properties and assets will belong to each spouse if their marriage ever ends in divorce. It is wise to have for any person with considerable assets, investments, or high value property. This type of agreement can't touch on any issues regarding child support or custody. In this video, we'll discuss the Uniform Premarital Agreement Act, the signing requirements in Texas, and the reasons a prenup is considered invalid. Before we start, make sure to grab your template for a Texas premarital agreement at the link below. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more videos by eForums, the world's largest database of official legal documents. First, let's review the Uniform Premarital Agreement Act. Texas is one of the 28 states that has adopted its version of the Uniform Premarital Agreement Act. This act was written in 1983 to standardize prenup laws across the country. Next, let's cover the signing requirements in Texas. A prenup has to be physically in writing and signed by both individuals. It only activates when the couple is actually married. Neither individual is required to retain an attorney for this process, but they are definitely recommended. Now, there are plenty of reasons a prenup is considered invalid. A prenup can be overturned if both individuals sign an agreement that nullifies the prenup. If a marriage dissolves, so will an associated prenup. A prenup can also be considered invalid if one individual didn't properly disclose their properties and assets, or one individual didn't sign it voluntarily. So where can you find legal documents online? If you're in need of a prenuptial agreement, an advance directive, a divorce agreement, a name change form, or any other form, we have thousands of state-specific ready-to-go templates available for you to download.